Hello everyone, please welcome and join me Easy Steps. Today I'm going to share with you Sheru's recovery, how we are coping as a family. He's our loving dog and he got hurt. From the bottom of my heart and from my family, I wish everyone Happy New Year. But I'd like to thank each and everyone who has sent their good wishes, prayer and blessing for Sheru's speedy recovery. He has been doing really well. Day 4 went well, day 5 went well. Today is a day 6 and he's doing really well. Right now he's sleeping. I'm making him a meal. He loves Easy Steps cooking meal. So I'm going to share with you what I'm doing it, what exactly I'm doing and how do I cook it in case if your pet is fussy and if you try this food, homemade food, the best food, your pet will love it. And trust me, it's going to feel better. And let's get started. I'm going to be making a chicken with the rice and with some vegetables. So what I'm going to do, I'll have a chicken leg. This is the fresh chicken legs. This is a chicken drumstick, Sheru loves it. So I'm going to get, grab five of these. Two, three, four, five. So I had to place the chicken drumstick in the pot. So I'll start a gas. We're going to keep the gas on high. I'm going to do very easy recipe. Sheru Bruno loves easy steps cooking. So I'm going to make it very simple and very easy. I have a four cup of water. You can add more pieces, but five chicken pieces is the best for this recipe. One cup of rice. And by the way, this is the basmati rice. Sheru loves basmati rice. You can use the long grain rice or any rice available to you. And when it comes to vegetable, Sheru loves vegetables. These are carrots. So, four, seven, These are cut and peeled baby carrot. So I'm going to use nine of these. I love sweet peas. In Punjabi we call it mutter. And Sheru loves it. He loves it what daddy loves it. So it's going to be like a handful. About this much. And a little bit more since he loves it. And one one of the best potato. My secret ingredient. And it's a peeled. I'm going to just cut it into small pieces. So what basically I'm going to do once uh, this one going to cook really well then I'm going to mash it not really mash it but I'm going to break it because uh, I have noticed that if you give a potato to Sheru he loves it but once it gets stuck in his jaw then he goes like this and that's really funny and then he takes a while to come back to the food again because uh, he wanted to make sure that his jaw is clean so I'm just making a small pieces that's it and now, this is strictly optional. I would not recommend anyone. Sheru loves Easy Steps cooking. Sheru loves Indian Punjabi style cooking. He is Alaskan Malamut and he is a Canadian. But when it comes to, he is half Indian. So he loves uh, food. I know many fat owners are going to say, oh this is not good, that is not good. As I said again, it's strictly optional. But when it comes to Sheru, you are the best judge. 
what is good for him. I'm going to use a very little salt, like a pin. Not too much, because if I give a bland food to Sheru, he won't eat it. But when it's come to easy steps cooking food, oh, he's drooling. He just loves it. Just for a flavor, a cumin powder. Then a pinch coriander powder, which is dhania powder. Not too much, it's just want to give a little flavor so he thinks that this is my food. But if I just treat him as a patient, he won't eat it. Patient in a way that if I give him a bland food, he's gonna say, no dad, I don't want to eat it. He loves hot and spicy food, trust me. There are some foods really hot when I'm eating it. He really loves enjoy eating with me. So I'm going to give a stir. Strictly optional, but when it comes to your own pet, you are the best judge. Have said many times, she loves easy steps cooking. So just to flavor, just to basically place uh, with his mind, I'm just going to use olive oil. As you see, just a few drops. It's just bringing a flavor into the dish, so he thinks, yes, this is the food. Dad eats it and I'm going to eat it with him and he's going to say yes, it's, it's dad's food and he will enjoy it. So I'm going to give him good stir. And we're going to cover with the lid and we'll cook it for 5 minutes on the high gas. It will take 15-20 minutes until the chicken is fully cooked and then we'll share with the shadow. The chicken drumstick, I'm going to take the chicken off and discard the bones. And it's very important. I know in the past I have uh, done one video where I have uh, given cooked bones to my shadow and Bruno, which is not really advisable because cooked bones are dangerous for intestines for the Sheru or Bruno or for your pet and it can be dangerous or can be really fatal. So it's really advisable not to give them cooked bone. Uncooked bone is okay. That part I wanted to share with you. Please don't feed cooked bones to your pet. I'm going to check on Sheru. I told my boy, Sheru is still waiting. Sheru, my boy is still waiting. He's waiting for his daddy. Daddy told him that I'm going to make a food for him. So he kind of falls asleep. He's doing good. He's a good boy. Sheru, everyone asking on YouTube, what happened to Sheru? Is he doing good? They're really worried about you. What happened to day four and day five? Yes, Sheru doing good. Let me remove this one too. We took him to the vet yesterday and uh, they checked the bandage, they said it look good, the splint look good. Today what I have done, uh, another thing, today I gave him a big uh, raw hide and he loved it. But when he was chewing, he was a little bit uh, drooling, so I wanted to make sure that uh, his uh, bandage don't get wet or anything. So I just put a plastic wrap. And so now I'm removing it and uh, I told him that uh, I have his uh, food, if we, you look at uh, I have all sort of food. I have his uh, favorite uh, chicken lamb, then uh, this one is with the chicken meat, but uh, he's a little bit fussy, he's not eating it, the water is there. But now I told him, okay, okay my boy, my boy, he wants to eat, uh, is he steps cooking? He said, yes dad, and trust me, honestly, I'm not lying. He does communicate really well. So I know what he's saying, what his feelings. He's my boy. And he's so good when it comes to, I mean, he's so understandable. And uh, if you notice, he haven't chewed it. I told him not to chew. He's, Shadow, uh, let me see. Uh, let me see your leg. His leg is getting better. Uh, even the back leg is getting better. 
Did the hair start coming out? Let me see, chill. Let me see. See, when I tell him, show me, he show me. See, it's doing good. So he's really doing nice. And uh, he's, he's a good boy. So, okay, I'm making your chicken. So you wait for me and then I'll come back. So I told him earlier, then I'll start a video on it and he falls asleep. So I'm gonna take this bone away from you, okay? No more, okay? Okay? No, stop it. See, I told him, he put it in his mouth, I told him stop it, he just don't want it. I don't wanna give it to him, I only give it to him when I'm around here because then I can see if he's drooling and the bandits don't get wet because the stitch is gonna come out on January 2nd. Okay, Sheru? Wait, wait, okay? After checking on Sheru, he's really excited, the food is coming up. So it's been five minutes, and as I can show it to you, how it looks. I'm going to open it, and I'm going to give a stir. Look, at the chicken drumsticks are doing well. The rice is doing good. The carrots are doing good, the potatoes are doing good, and the peas, mortar, is doing good. So after mixing it well and it looking really nice, and I'm going to put the cover on. Now I'm going to bring the gas on uh, medium and I'm going to cook it for 10 to 15 minutes until the chicken is fully cooked. Another 5 minutes of cooking, open the lid, it's nicely done and if I going to check this is about potatoes I put a big pieces so what I'm gonna do I mash it this is fully cooked and same thing with the carrots they are cooked as well you can see so I'm going to make a small pieces of this what I'm gonna do with the as for the chicken this is really important I left the skin on because uh, they enjoy the skin. So I'm going to grab the chicken leg and the chicken meat is also cooked. So I will uh, take the chicken out and uh, once the chicken is uh, in a small pieces like this, then I'm going to leave the bones also inside. So on the each piece I'm going to take the chicken out and I'm going to leave the bones inside and I'm going to cook another 5 minutes. His food is all ready. And I'm going to open the lid. Wow, he's going to love it. This is the chicken bones I'm going to take him out. I did cook another five minutes. And the chicken, rice, potatoes, and the carrots, and the peas, the mutter. This is his favorite. This is a favorite meal for Sheru. Have you heard that noise? Sheru, I'm bringing the food for you. He is going to love it. So I'm going to feed him once and then I'm going to feed him later in the evening. So this will be, this will be a good food. So. I'm going to give him a couple minutes so it can cool down and he will be waiting patiently. Let's go up there and let's feed him. Cheru! Cheru! Food is ready and I'm going to set up my table so I can sit down and this is my big boy. Come here, come sit down, relax. Oh! He Good boy, you smell it? He's already, he's all excited. He's so much excited. He's excited. He's excited. Goo -boo -goo -boo. Let's put your leg away so we can put it, your ball in right here. Aha! The food is still hot. It's really warm. Please don't feed the cooked bone to your pets. I'm going to discard those, I'm not going to get them. Ha ha! Sheru! I'm going to make you... Oh, I'm going to try it. First, this is not a dog food. This is easy steps cooking. But this food is for the pet. 
Mmm. 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 It's really tasty. I'm not kidding. I'm not joking. This is really good. Cheru. I'm going to make sure that when I'm going to give him, I'm going to smash with my fingers because the meat is still warm. I don't want him to get burned. He's already started drooling. He loves the food. And look at the food up here. He doesn't care. Okay. Slowly, slowly. Take that one too. See, that's his favorite food. And he's going to enjoy it. Chiloli, bite it. Yes. Good. You like it? Yeah? I'm going to put it here. No licking now, okay? This is the carrots. He loves carrot, but I just uh, try to mash it. And also this way it does uh, two things. Once it cools down, other one, he enjoys it. Okay, slowly wait, wait. What I'm gonna do, I'm going to make sure that uh, I just feed him so he knows that uh, this is the food that he's going to get it and he's going to enjoy it. But at this moment, the food is still warm. Only thing I'm going to do, I'm going to make sure that still it's hard for me to also touch it because it's so warm. And I'm just uh, preparing for him. So it's cooling down. And um, the cutlass on the bones that he enjoys it, that I'm going to take it out. And the rest of the bone, I'm going to discard it. Like this one. See, there is a cutlass. Cheru, chew it slowly. So he enjoys it. So what I'm going to do, I will uh, I'll finish it, make sure no bone. I'm not going to give him the bone, okay? So this is the cartilage he enjoys. No touching, okay? No. Let me put it here, okay? You have to wait. You are such a disciplined baby. Everyone loves you on the YouTube. Go. So he really enjoys it. I'm making sure that uh, all the food is uh, cool down. I wanted to make sure that he don't get uh, burned. That's uh, really important. Hands are all dirty, I'll clean it. I'm gonna make sure that I will transport everything to Sheru. And Sheru going to enjoy his uh, meal. And try this recipe for your pet, and they will love it. Shiru, come, enjoy. Shiru likes it. Shiru loves it. Shiru is really enjoying his food, and uh, as you can see, he's really recovering well. And um, it's all your wishes and prayers. Bring him. And give him good strength and I really appreciate each one of you caring for my shiru as much as we care we really love him we feel really sad that he's a kind of uh, limited to his activities and uh, but he's of a family that's uh, the main thing it's all about family so as you can see, he's uh, having a good time, it's a good lunch and he's a favorite meal, Easy Steps Cooking. So when it comes to Easy Steps Cooking, my pets really enjoy it. And uh, I have to say good boy, I'm going to wash up. Thank you for joining Easy Steps and uh, I'll share with you Sheru's progress on coming days uh, when we're going to take him to the web the stitches to be taken out on the January 2nd and uh, thanks for thinking again of him and take care. Easy steps on Sheru and my whole family like to wish each and everyone out there Happy New Year 2017. Happy New Year. Thank you. Bye bye. And look at Sheru.